Walk softly. The worm could be lurking around here. Well, don't just stand there, Frankie. Keep busy. This backyard's a beehive of activity. If you like music, buzz yourself over to the spider web. The spider may have eight legs, but he sure could use an extra hand. And there's plenty more to do. You just have to look around. You'll be as busy as I am in no time. Look at that spider's web. It's huge. That must be the World Wide Web everybody's talking about. Sorry, man, to drop in on you, but I noticed you have an ear. In fact, you have two. Two ears, right here where they belong. What's it to you? When spiders make music, we're all out of luck. We don't have ears, and without ears, we're stuck. Bring your floppy ears to the spider web fast. You can help us make music. It'll be a blast. But without ears, your music must be pretty off-key. Hey, I've got an idea. Why don't I help out? I've got plenty of ear to spare. Look how long they are. Frankie, my boy, happy you're here. What I need is a dog with a musical ear. My spot of music's got no ring to it. It sounds so bad, you can't even sing to it. Well, I've got ears. Long, floppy ones, see? I can help you out. Dig it, Frankie. We'll make a hit. Just tell the stage manager where the band should sit. Until each spider takes a seat, spider music won't have the beat. We need the right number on every seat, or spider music won't have a beat. Move the stage manager with your mouse, then click to catch the musician who will rock the house. them. Row number two, ready for you. Here we have the very last row. That means it's almost time for the show. For Frankie, that's your prize. You've got a big heart for a dog your size. Get 
ready, band, to take a seat. Frankie's here with the backyard beat. It's quiet around here. Too quiet if you ask me. Frankie, if I were you, I wouldn't hang around here too long. For all we know, that Wrigley Worm might be heading this way. If you feel like building sandcastles, that's the place to be. Or run over to the butterflies. The baby caterpillars are about to experience their magical metamorphosis. It's quite a sight. Hey, you, fella. That pointy nose of yours looks sort of familiar. Where have I seen your face before? Right where it always is. On my head. You're Frankie, the dog who knocked down all my sandcastles. Well, buddy boy, here's my chance to put you to work. Tell me something. Can you spackle and paint? Can you saw, screw, nail, or file? Um, to tell you the truth, I can't do any of those things. Good, because I don't need you for that. Just go down the path over there till you get to the giant sandbox. After my donut break, I'll meet you there and show you what to do. I'll see you at work, bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. Run for your lives! It's Frankie! Yo, Frankie, you scared off all my workers. Sorry, Beetle Boss. I guess they remember me from when I was big. <coughs> well, Frankie, since I don't have any workers left, guess what? You're hired. You're too small now to knock down sandcastles, but you're plenty big enough to build them. Just yank that popsicle stick to get started. First, you take a block from the tower under me, then drag it to the proper space on the castle. It's that simple. Talk about being in good shape. Nice job. The sandcastle is shaping up nicely. Thanks to you. Yahoo! That building's a beaut. Go ahead, Beatles. Heave! Ho! Stand back, stand back! Don't want anyone to get hurt now, do we? This is almost as fun as running in circles! You're so good at this, I should hire you to build me a new doghouse. Yahoo! Atta boy, Frankie. Good job. Beetles, lift and carry. Off we go. <laughs> Break's over. It's work time again. Doing a great job. The boss should make you employee of the month. Talk about being in good shape. Nice job. Bill Frankie is a bone. 
Consider it a worker bonus. Good work, Frankie. I see a promotion in your future. Beatles carry! Such good news, Frankie. You now have enough bones to earn another magic dog tag. Click on the magic dog tag on the toolbar or meet me back at the Queen Bee's tree. Pardon me, mister, but I'm in a pickle. The name is Butterfly, Mrs. Butterfly. What's the matter, Mrs. Butterfly? Honey, I am the mother of the most talented baby caterpillars you ever did see. I am talking stars, big stars. But my babies can't become stars until they reach their cocoon. Can you help a stage mother out? Me? Of course I can help. I'm sure it's quite a sight. I wouldn't have it any other way. Follow me, sweetie. Wait for me, Mrs. Butterfly. Big smile, my beautiful baby. Stand up straight. Here's that wonderful mammal I was telling you about. That funny-looking caterpillar is your baby? He may be a caterpillar now, but once you help him reach his cocoon, why then, it's showtime! See the missing sections in the path to the cocoon? They need to be filled in one by one. Click on the branch that fits and drag it into place. It's just like building bridges. Hop to it and build those bridges. True talent waits for no dog, however tiny. What a fit! A perfect fit! Keep going! What a relief! for the big costume change. They're not just ordinary stars, they're shooting stars. The show business is in their blood. Their grandmother was Madam Butterfly. Ever heard of her? Frankie, you've built a bridge to our hearts. Here's one of your prized bones. Yahoo! Hop to it and build those bridges. True talent waits for no dog, however tiny. Okie dokie, Ruby. All set to earn my first magic dog tag. But after I climb up the tree, how do I get down again? Getting down's the easy part. Just concentrate on climbing up. Now get busy and click on the first magic dog tag. The magic dog tag is almost within reach. All you have to do is climb. I'm not a cat, you know. I can't just claw my way to the top. That's where the bones come in. All you have to do is click on each bone and drag it to the correct position. Step by step, we could climb to the moon. Step right up. 
I'd prefer an escalator, but you can't have everything. Good for you. You've been busy as a bee. And for all your busy work, you've earned yourself a magic dog tag. All right, now what? Maybe that path goes somewhere. <laughs>